it is time for this week's slam of the week. I'd like to give a shout out to my man Bjorn, who um, is the creator of EdListen.com, does his weekly podcast there, and he is the creator of this template, which is a, a script actually um, that I'm going to show you. And so, if you don't know, you can always create uh, from templates and just from your drive and say from template. And I've already pulled this up and searched for it. This is called G Class Folders. Search for it in the public templates. Say select use this template and it will pull this up. You'll see I retitled it already and this is just test information. And so I filled all this information out already and I've run the script once. Um, but just to let you see that this option will come up and you run these three steps. It takes all but 20 seconds to do so and it will automatically share um, three different folders to your students. So let me show you what this looks like from the student account. So see I'm signed in here on this other window is this test user and um, say I have the sample document that I'd like to add to my Dropbox. You'll notice that there's a view only folder, an edit folder, and a Dropbox. Dropbox is where the student would submit their final product. Um, in these folders are where you as the teacher would submit documents that you would want to be either view only or edit only permissions and um, the thing definitely suggests is that the student goes ahead and drags and drop this to their drive they can also create a parent folder for them at very least this Dropbox folder needs to be in their drive and um, you'll see here I'm gonna do is put the sample doc in the Dropbox and that's it. The student has turned in their work. Let, me let you see now what this looks like from the teacher view. So teacher now opens up that folder and notice they have their three folders that they were created for them by the G class folder script and they have this one that says student drop boxes and they have a drop box for each and every student with the names and you'll also see um, just by looking at this a quick glance hmm a student has has put new work in their Dropbox at 12 o'clock so click on that and see oh there it is and as a teacher I can now open up this document and read it add my comments and um, the student will get email notifications as I add comments so very very simple process can't thank Bourne enough for that. There's your slam of the week.